Hello, viewers. Welcome back to Public Praise. I'm here with Emmanuel Jean Vier. Hi, how Hi, are you doing? I'm great. I'm very good. You are doing so many yes, things, so Manny. So many things. Like juggling. It's a juggling act. Yes, pretty much. You <laughs> are the creator and visionary behind Nightlight. Yep. Please tell us about that. Yeah, Nightlight, well, um, Pastor Troy from New Dimension Church entrusted me with this um, amazing vision that he had two mm -hmm. years before Nightlight started. Wow. And Nightlight's pretty much a movement that creates a platform for different artists to um, just express themselves through the creativity. Mm -hmm. We have spoken word, singing, rapping, um, what else, dancing, live painting on the side. It's pretty mm -hmm. much a night of arts and worship. Four times That's a year. Amazing. Yeah. Um, you said it's four times a year. Are you yeah. trying to travel with it and make it a regular thing? A lot thing? of people has been talking about it, saying that Nightlight's going to travel. It's going to take over arenas. I'm like, oh, that's so huge. Um, so, yeah, definitely. I, I know what God's trying, uh, trying to do with Nightlight. He's mm -hmm. really trying to rise up the sons and daughters to take over the arts and entertainment mountain because there's so much creativity God wants to release through us. Mm -hmm. And it all happens when we understand who we are. Um, in God and creating from the place of intimacy, you know, um, and hearing what God's saying at that moment and putting it, embodying it with dancing and singing and all these different creativity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. So not only do you do a nightlight, you're also a praise and worship leader at I'm New Dimension. I'm a worship Dimension. leader, yes. And you are also a minister at New Dimension. I yep. feel like when I watch you at church, it's like watching Heyman. You're always doing something. Wait, who's Heyman? Okay. <laughs> Remember back in the day? Oh, you're too young. In living yeah. color? Okay. You don't know. I'm anything? just going to act like I know what you're saying. I'm going to send you a clip of okay. Heyman because it's this, this is a Jamaican family oh. and they're all doing like 25 jobs. Oh, yeah. And you're oh. doing. 25 jobs I, at the church. I'm doing so many things. Um, it, it, it's a diff It's just a mix. It's like um, um, being a worship leader, um, taking lead over this huge nightlight movement that's a huge buzz in um, Providence, Rhode Island. I'm an actor mm -hmm. and I'm also writing songs and get ready for my album coming up September. Like I'm starting to work mm -hmm. on it in September. So it's a lot of stuff, but God's really placed arts and entertainment in my heart. Mm -hmm. So it's so funny how he's allowing all these things to happen all at once. Mm -hmm. But it's, 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 it's busy, but it's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're enjoying yourself good, while busy. you're doing busy, it. Busy, good. Good. <laughs> well, we'll be back for more public praise right after this. Commercial. Commercial break. Yeah. Freeing her as she was looking at that dancer, as she was watching it. And that's the great thing about art. People usually take it as like, um, it's just entertainment. But mm -hmm. really, God has given us, a, given us creativity. And we really believe creativity is dominion and authority. Amen. What does it look like when the sons and daughters of the Creator rise up to create? Using the very gifts that were given to them to liberate those who don't believe that they were born for something special. We were born to create, to bring life to the dark places, to bring something new that the world has never seen before, to give a voice to our Creator. So what should we do? Should we then hide and bury our gifts or should we take it and make it our own for creation? eagerly awaits for the glory that comes out of our bones. So take a stand, even if you're alone, declaring that I was born to sing, that I was born to dance, that I was born to cry. 